Supporters turn out in New Hampshire to hear the 45th president speak. One America's Daniel Baldwin caught up with just a few of them. Take a look. Why do you want to spend your Monday out here supporting President Trump? Quite frankly, it was an opportunity I couldn't pass up because I've never been to a rally. This is my first one. And I was close enough that I said, I'm going. It was important for me to support this particular man because of what he's done for us in the years when he was president. And how do you, what about President Trump's message really resonates with you as a voter and an American citizen? His patriotism and his honesty, blunt honesty. And a lot of people are coming after him because he is so honest. And he tells the truth. And we can see, we, we're all waking up nowadays as to his message and protecting America because right now, as we all know, it's falling apart. President Trump is the one that we do believe in, uh, uh, the one and only that to be able to save America with what's uh, going on right now. You know, look back in four years ago, so he presidents, you know, he handled everything good for the country, and right now you can see the completely difference. You look in the gas station, the, the price go up, the grocery go up, and look in the border, terrible. And look in the world. Right now, the world all over. Yeah, that's so bad. Need him back four more years. You, you're waiting in line to see President Trump speak here today. Why did you choose to spend your day this way? Before I die, I have to meet this man. <laughs> he is the greatest president in my lifetime. He has done more for our military and for our country than any other president that we have seen. I could not not come here. <laughs> so is this your first time seeing him in person? It is. Walk me through the emotions that you're feeling. Or is there a lot of like anticipation, like bu like butterflies? I'll cry. She'll I'll cry. cry. I, I just love this man. I just think he's the greatest thing. What this country has put this man through is just inconceivable. And I want him to know that we support him and that we believe in him and we know that he's doing the right thing for this country.